Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome to episode 100 of Rimworld Freedom's Drift. 100, and we got four of them over here that are, you know, drifting. They're, they're drifting back. I ran the game an extra day between this episode and last. To get them a little further along, we've got 1.6 days left, so that maybe they will get here to celebrate the 100th episode. That'd be nice. Otherwise did a bunch of other things while or in between these two episodes um came up with an inspiration at one point while they were off doing all their their little things you know getting that greenhouse worked on and whatnot this was it this one i think it was this one um heater went bad and sea stars with her construction skill of five went over there and repaired it and then i realized you know we're down to 25 of the components left it would be smart to get a components a, a components bench up and running soon, but where do we put it, and how do we power it? I mean, we haven't even got half the base powered yet, and we're floundering on power right now. And there's nowhere to put more solar panels or wind generators or whatnot. I mean, we could get a whole bunch more of these going, but then we're going to be dependent upon trying to produce enough of the chem fuel and we're already hurting on wood again and it's gonna be like you know like going out to get meat all the time it just we're always on fumes and how do we power everything that way and trying to work my way through that conundrum an inspiration hit me we need to get rid of things that need power <laughs> when you're broke stop buying things how do we do that though i don't know if the if the um, uh, components bench or whatever it's called draws power, I'm assuming it does. We've got the machining table that takes 350 watts right there. And are there any other production uh, systems that we don't really have up and running yet that that's been waiting? And where are we going to put it? I really wanted it right here in the center, and we kind of ran out of room because we're going to have all of our storage right in here. So I got to clicking on things, and the the research bench is. 250 i already pulled out the second one there's 500 there's 200 this guy takes 200 a couple of lamps at 150 watts so there's a thousand watts sitting right there uh these guys the sewing um try that again sewing tailor benches you know takes 120 watts of two of those and another two uh, light bulbs in there there's another one in there somewhere but time you add all these things up it just it just makes it just requires so much power how do we deal with this and i got to thinking you know over on this side of the river we've got more power we know what to do with although we are finally hitting a balance point with this i actually saw the batteries drain a little bit when i turned these guys back on i went ahead and roofed them after last episode because we're 38 degrees we're not far above freezing right now so we it's time to Put roofs back on and start using these and there's more of my power drain but over here we've got another geyser over there for another uh geothermal generator there's one right there there's one right over here somewhere right there there's a fourth one somewhere so over here anyway we got lots of power there's one over there too we got lots of power on this side of the river is that another one no that's a dead turkey or what is that <laughs> actually where did the all well, the pigs go well, they're already skeletons now okay so it was a turkey anyway how do we get power that it's abundant on this side but there's none of it on this side not enough and that's when i came up with this let's get production over onto this side of the river i think that's our ultimate answer let's get rid of or move this room right here the sewing in fact all the sewing and all of the the cloth and leathers that are taking up so much space over here valuable space because we're kind of constricted over here and get that into this area where we can take as much room as we want in fact maybe someone can be over here and i don't know what will be i just started throwing this together as, as an example i don't know if that's what way it's going to truly end up looking but get all the production over there and save this side for living and the prison which really doesn't take that much power it's light bulbs and a heater for the most part um really not even any auto doors except for these two yeah so that's not that much of a power hog but get the hospital over here get the kitchen over here get living over here 
and of course dining and recreation and the and the uh, the prison and the main storage so instead of this area we can transport all the cloth and leather off over there all of this over there and this whole thing can be a storage bay just for clothes just for what do they call them here um i need a stockpile there we go they call them apparel okay so a whole bunch of these wooden shelves rack back and forth like a like a, a supermarket of you know like a walmart store full of clothes over in here where we need them but we can make them over there and then have a handy dandy dog bring it over here and load it on a shelf so i think this is the future of this colony I'm going to start diversifying a little bit here and and make this work so that's the plan there and i also let's see over here where are we at needs i haven't started up yet because i want to see what ruby's doing but we're at the very end of the sleep, so they're going to start walking soon. So, just like the whole trip over there, nothing happened over here. It was really uneventful, so which is a good thing. Over here, I turn this on. I think I can turn it on. I had another idea of possibly having Grandma, so she's a good cook, to do what Natalia is doing by... Um, I see Sea Stars just in refueling. Good. Um... Bugsy is pregnant by having her as a as a night shift doctor. Let's have grandma as a night shift cook So until we get over into the kitchen, which is still gonna be you know, a few episodes at least She she and Chantico can share this and, and make meals and possibly get into more of the, uh, the prepackaged survival meals and You know get ahead of our, of our 60 count as well as continue butchering through the night and all that Recipes already getting started over here and sea stars um Let's do that while I'm thinking of it. Let's see, that is... Actually, that's right here. So, Grandma, you are going to be on that shift right there. And we're going to get rid of this. Eventually, you'll get back into the uh, into that cycle. I can see right now everyone's pretty much into their normal cycle again. After all those uh, weird hours, they're finally getting back to more of a normal sleep time. Um, who is up right now? Natalia got done with the medicine. She made 61 and went up on her own to over here and started to smelt down a slag chunk. Got rid of, I see a dog's already hauled it away, made 10 steel and then left there as quick as she could. She wanted nothing more to do with that. <laughs> she came right down here and started block cutting. <laughs> so... Kathra is getting up and is going to do some harvesting. That's good. Um, Michael is up. He is making gibble, which we are still quite low on, but we get I got enough in between episodes done so that they can survive. So we'll get back up to our 600 mark soon. We brought in all the animals that we hunted and pretty much uh, getting back to some kind of normal. This be you are working over here. Alicia's sleeping. Eric is up and he is working on a granite wall. This is going to be Klaus's new room and Sangria if they, if they continue and get to the wedding ceremony, which I assume they will. So Eric, I want you instead. Let's see if we can't get this greenhouse up and going before they get here. How does that sound? Um, Power-wise, I got that correct now, right? Yeah. So, power comes in chooses a battery bank goes down hits a switch fires up this turret up around over here this turret over here this turret and hits the next switch so we can fire up from both ends and I just need to complete this loop here to get this going they did on their own get that sun lamp going while it was raining and I happened to see that after I stopped recording so I quickly shut that down didn't explode thankfully but power is good there let's check power over here right there so now power is coming in choose which of these circuits we want to use of the battery circuits to store and then continues on into the base so that's working better too but with this on and with another heater or two here and there because it's getting cold around they're all the ones that are on are starting to run a lot more in fact how are the rooms i haven't even thought to look 58 degrees it's time to turn these on too we're you know, with all of this and all of these, we're still not really getting a full charge anymore. 
That's what got me worrying about power. How are we going to pull this off? Do I need to get this over there immediately and start building generators in this area? So we still going to have to do something like that real soon. But I think that solution, if we can dump this thousand as soon as possible, that's going to help out a lot. We'll see. Um, we could... Uh, there it is. We could shut these down. I didn't thought. I didn't thought about that. These don't take power, or don't use power. What else is here that can be shut down? Well, before I get into that, so Eric, let's have you pop over. Bring me some stones for. Actually, do this one right here in case it goes so many uh, spaces one side or the other. David, you're consuming a meal. Let's see, Eric. Your food is fine. Okay, so David is grabbing a meal that I want him to... Boy, I don't think Eric's going to grab this one, and that is so far away. It's two trips. I'll tell you what. Just come on over here and, and work on this one. And one of you guys, when you're over here, I'll tell you to do that one, and you'll grab it out of here. That works. Okay, so that's that. Grandma is consuming a fine meal. She's up. And Sea Stars is over here digging away. Kaya's up. Consuming a fine meal. I think I just said failed on purple. But purple has been fed, which is a good thing. Mood is okay. Alright, it's it's happening. Are these guys moving? They are. 1.4 days away. What does that mean? So kind of the end of tomorrow? I think that's what I'm getting out of that. So, David, you kinda got distracted, didn't you? What? Oh no, you're going for you're going for the uh, the stone, right? Yeah. Where's Eric? Okay, he's on his way. Okay, as soon as he lays this out, then I'll send him up to get this one done. Otherwise, I think all the wood for the doors is in. Okay, so what did you bring? Brought that and that. Good. And then pop over and work on that one. Great. That takes care of all that. Now what? Shantigo, you are cooking a fine meal. Let's have you haul all of that over. And just go as far as you can, then you'll dive into butchering. That will uh, that'll clean up a lot of... Uh, that'll give us a lot more uh, flexibility there for kibble and for cooking. Um, be nice to get somebody to butcher constantly. Michael, there you go. Good. Grandma. You are milking a muffalo. Eric failed at construction. Okay, then where isn't Eric? He's already off to go get more blocks. He's going to get that no matter what. <laughs> so, Kaya, cutting blocks, and you're starting with marble. What do we need? We need marble. Okay, that works. You'll do that one. It'd be nice to get somebody else in here to do this one. Minor break risk is Sea Stars because she's had it with working over here, right? Needs, Joy's building but not fast enough so your mood is really low because your beauty is at the bottom okay what if we were to come up and work on this instead there's still two of them to cut out of here and eventually we need to get these two strange there's only two there i guess there could be two more behind here hmm worried about punching into that and getting a raid and have them start grenading at or something hmm but that might make her feel a little better. It's, 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 more, it's more beautiful out here. In fact, can we see that? You're already kind of bouncing around up in there, tanked again, because you are going through the ugly place right here. Yep. All the rubble, all of the storage. Pop outside, though, and we should see this one dive off to the side. Whoa, all the way to there. Big difference. Less... Beautiful over here, though. But it's enough to get this moving, which should get this moving, which should... Mm, yeah. Relaxing socially. That will do even better. Okay, that works. So, Kethra is harvesting this stuff. Everybody's going to go relax socially, aren't they? Rabbit, what you up to? You are going to harvest hay grass. You... Yeah, you need your joy, too. Okay, you guys have a ball. How are these guys doing? Over here, we've gone a little further. Rest is fine. Food is fine. 
they're making good time. <laughs> Bringing that orbital power beam targeter back with them so we can figure out what on earth we're going to do with it. I hate to waste that on mechs. That's been suggested. Mech shit comes in and just, you know, target it and obliterate everything. But I kind of like, you know, not only the fun of the battle, but taking them to the machine bench and getting some... It's not here anymore. There was... Oh, that's right. I did set this. Did it work? It worked. Plasteel out of them. I set these guys for one of each kind of something that we might want to build something out of here in the art studio. So I seem, that's, that was the original intent with this. As well, this was going to be where the uh, all the statues are placed when they're made. But <clears throat> right now I need them to be in a place where I can sell them until we get to a point where, you know, that's, that's not an issue. You know, is there a way to choose? There is. So there's quality. Ooh. I guess I've already thought about this too. So the good on up. The superior. Okay. So we can tell all of the superior to legendaries to go here. And then eventually they get placed and everything else goes into a stockpile. Okay. In that case, I can go ahead and set you up to important. Okay, well, we'll start doing that. That was a weird pause. Hmm. Catherine's over here. You are viewing art. And is that exciting? Apparently it is. In fact, so much so, you can go back and sew an area. Thank you. Kaya, did you get a break? Apparently you did. Your joy's up there. Okay. So, hmm. They're probably capable of getting this done today. I worry about sewing this right now but I guess oh you're not sewing it you're cutting down trees well and you're sewing you're doing both okay all right well we'll try and get a roof on that tonight hopefully it'll work Michael I've set this area oh that's oh that's so frustrating I set this area as the highest priority critical to get hay over here so while they're making kibble they'll grab it from here and yet they still make the trip over to grab hay from here why is that I don't get it. You're making kibble. Let's watch this. You've got a hold of 18 meat. So somehow you're going to get a hold, I guess, two more over here. And Shantigo's butchering now. Good. Mm, yeah. I was going to say, no, you're kibbling, but no, you're butchering. Let's see what he does for hay grass this time. Look at that. Why is that? What am I getting wrong here? Oh, oh, here's a possibility. Let's do this. Although, it works for now, but it's going to fail later. I was going to say, let's move the kibble, the distance available. Um, what am I looking at here? This one, radius. Take that on down to just include this hay grass right here. So, Michael, if I do that... Let's see what you do. You're going to start all over again. You're grumbling and griping and, and you're grabbing hay grass from here now. Okay. Well, let's do that temporarily, at least for these two. Make kibble distance take you down. I've already done that for this one. Okay. All right. So those two, I can't really do that for these two. Though the plan when these start happening is to get hay grass in this, this area right here. Then that should always take care of that. A wild boar is pregnant. So, animals, how are we doing over here? One, two, three, four, five dogs are pregnant. And one, two, three wild boars, two boomalopes are pregnant. We've got a cow pregnant, and we've got two muffalo pregnant. Oh, boy. Is is 9,000 hay grass enough? That's what I want to know. <laughs> Who would have thought I'd ever have that much in here? And that's what I was noticing. We're actually losing power for the first time on this side. So all the little stuff we got going on, the doors, this guy over here, which I guess we'll go ahead and just turn off for now to save us, and the two lights, and this is no longer keeping up. So sometime this winter, we need to tap this guy, bring it in, maybe a triple. That would work. Yeah, a triple uh, greenhouse over here, and another uh, generator, just kind of, you know, mirror... Mirror image this thing. I wonder if I can get two in there. 
major growing operation. I just wish that that could be over here and close by. That's a long walk. Hmm. Be, up, be even further now because we got to cross the river and go all the way over to here to drop it off. Instead of right there. Yep. You guys, oh, we're closer. We're on the next mountain range. Rest is halfway down. It's five in the evening. Grandma should be in bed, and she is good. Just think about evening. So she is now officially on night shift, though she's probably going to be done with her rest here real soon. Yeah, so you're starting your night shift way early. But you'll be taking over, probably butchering. No, no, you're not even cooking right now until Sangri gets back. Then you're back to cooking. Yeah, I could have delayed that a day. Oh, well, by then you'll be back on schedule. Yeah, that works. But you won't be able to do much with the animals once they're asleep, will you? Um, can't think of anything you would do with sleeping animals. No, I don't think you can milk a sleeping animal, can you? I mean, forget about in real life. In, in Rimworld, can you? <laughs> Where's David at? You did get back down there. Let's help out over here and see if we can get this done today. So, pop into that one. Uh, failed. Okay, that's fine. You know where there's more. And I'm sure the pigs have delivered more. No, they haven't. Hmm. Now, otherwise... A couple of chickens. Just think of what else we want to get done today. Lots of animals out here. I'm assuming that some of them... Although these may all be the non-hauling ones. Juvenile, yeah. I need animals to haul this stuff in. So we don't have to do it. Well, let's think about things. Rabbit is consuming a fine meal. Shantigo is cooking a fine meal. We've got lots of meat there. Good. Kethra, you are... Everybody's eating. Natalia's up. She's eating. <laughs> well, Michael's making kibble. It's, he's making dog eats. Miss B is down here digging. Is that what we want? Maybe so. That's where you're naturally going to go until this is finally done. So, yeah. We'll get into here soon, but maybe I'll shift her over later on tonight. It's night shift time. Alicia, you are just about the end of your day, and you're sowing roses. I thought I had all these turned off. Apparently, I didn't. Okay, no point in that. They're all going to die soon. Sowing this area. Nope, that is done. This is done. Um, you can certainly harvest some of that. Uh, where are you going now? Now you're sowing this area. Okay, that'll be fine. Um, ooh, we're close. David, did you never not, not get here? Oh, you're consuming a meal. Uh, needs, yeah. Let's make this happen. So you, afterward, are going to fill that in. No, that's no good. Um, well, break that. And Eric, finish that. Need to get David over here. Okay, he, Eric is going to do this one. But how do I get David into this area? Let's have you just. David, cut down a tree. Cutting him. That way he's here when it's time to put the roof on. That's what I want him for. Although, David, you could get this heater going. Let's go that route in case you gotta bring a. Yeah, a. What? Oh. Caravan ambushed. It happened. Casey's got to get a component, I was trying to say. By the saber donkeys. Okay, where are we at? Jump to location. One, two, three, four, five of them. We've got a knife, three of the bolt action rifles, and a revolver. And a bunch of pigs. Interesting place. Hmm. We're up in here. Okay, we got lots of time to plan for this. And all of the iron or, or steel. Boy. Now, question for you. Can I get to world map? How do I not mess this up? If I go here, right there, okay. Can we go to any one of these and hit... If we hit settle, are, are, we, do we, are we stuck there? How do I go in to zoom in on a place to decide if we want to settle there? Is that possible yet? Or is that an update 1.0 sort of thing? Anyway, you, let's zoom in. 
So, you know, this looks kind of interesting as far as settling in to form a little outpost or something, but it's only because we got ambushed that we got to see it. So how do I get to see other parts of the world? So let me know if you know that answer. Otherwise, what are we going to do for these guys? They're going to come through probably right into here. Where are we going to be? We need to ambush them, but we need cover. Probably need cover there, but they're going to have cover. If, hmm, I need to get these guys out into the open. Around like so. I guess really a wall like that is, is the, probably the best cover. Um, boy, that doesn't work for us. That doesn't work. If they turn the corner... Okay, so I'm thinking Klaus, like there, handy. There's nowhere else to work. I could kind of put her here. Klaus most likely won't hit her, but it is a little close. I mean, they're all in line. They're all going to shoot like this. Somebody right here, where well, they're so close that the the uh, accuracy goes up as the closer they get. If you ever noticed that. If I go to here, let's see, where have I seen that before? It wasn't just shooting accuracy. There was more than that. I guess it was. In, it's in the gun. So, Handy's weapon, gear, right there. Your accuracy. So, right in there, short distance is where she's the most accurate. So, if I were to get... You know, put her here and they turn the corner and stop right there. They're also at a very good accuracy against her. So it doesn't do us any good there. Um, okay, one here. Possibly one there. One over here may be good. Uh, that would be handy. You get the fastest run speed. You hopped over there. Sangria and Tomislav. I really don't want Tomislav shot and killed. This is our best doctor and our only doctor on the trip here. He's still got to be the one to put us back together again. Um, okay. Let me stare at this a little bit longer. This is likely the place they're coming through. We go there and there. That's only room for two. I. This looks like a great place, but we're shooting through this. I could put somebody right there. But they won't necessarily even have a line of sight against, you know, when they stop short just to hit this one. Hmm. Bad area. If we make a run for this area, what have we got? We have one point there and one point there. Again, bad area. If we make a run all the way down into here, they could continue to come up and then come up behind us. As well as split and go this way and then surround us. That's no good either. Boy, this is a tough little spot. I can't get here fast enough to make them go. They're going to follow us around if we go this way. So it's here or here, one or the other. We do have cover over here, but I'm pretty sure leaning out from a wall is better cover than just behind a chunk. What is this? Slate. Ah, okay, we don't have slate on our map. Okay, well, Klaus... They're shooting down the length and probably hitting this stone every single time. Um, hmm. I think our best chance is right in here. I really do. The trees do provide quite a bit of cover, especially in darkness. Klaus... Let's try putting you there. Hopefully that works rather than up above or diagonal. I think that's the best chance. Handy, you got a faster run speed. Let's get you out to here. Sangria, well, I would love to use these rocks, but I don't think you can shoot through the trees. So I think you're like there. Well, we can readjust a little bit as we need to. Tomislav, hmm... That puts you kind of over here with the ability to run out over this way to get behind if this is really going bad. Animals, where are you going to go? We only have the two, but I need the two. Boy, if we lost everything now, hopefully you just stay there. Yeah, okay. You guys, let's just take this one stage at a time. You're running up. You're recalculating. 
Klaus is in place. Handy's running across, getting their attention. Sangra's there. Okay, what do we got? Klaus has got a name. Handy, are you in the right place? I guess I need you there. Let's see if that works any better. Okay, bullet already coming in. Is Klaus, he's hidden behind these trees. Whose bullet was that? Probably, well, boy, I wish I could... You're one of them. Okay, here we go. You're the one who's fired. Your aim at Klaus is 0.59%. Good. Not in range. Okay, Handy still doesn't have a shot after all that. I don't like that, though. I just don't. It don't, seems like there's enough cover there. You on Handy. 8% chance. Yeah, that's not good. Handy, you head to... Here. You head to here, then go into there. I will give that a try. Boom, boom, boom. Now, you just shot, and you're shooting for Klaus, too. You've got a 19% chance. Klaus, back. Okay, you shoot Lupa, okay? Or Lu Lucia. That'd be nice. Um, Klaus, what to do with you? What to do with you? You stopped there. Turn around. Okay, so you got a knife coming in. Okay, so Tomislav, aim at. Fire at. Sangria. Fire at. Let's concentrate fire. Klaus, what have you? You have a revolver, which shoots quickly. You fire at. Now, Lucia, character, you don't know how to shoot. Thank you. Hutch, you do a little bit. Whoa. Char is a problem. He's a soldier. And you are Mitsuya? Mitsuya. And you kind of know how to shoot. Okay, well, let's see how this goes right now. Handy's heading back into that area. Hmm, hopefully this doesn't go horribly wrong. Okay, didn't hit Klaus. Still haven't hit Klaus. Take out that melee. Oh, oh, oh. Who shot that? I think those two did. Where Klaus is at, 0.59. And you get the skill. You're 19%. You're a problem. One out of five shots is going to hit home. And you're using a bolt action, which is pretty powerful. Gear. Damage. 18. As compared to a assault rifle. Damage. Am I right, Klaus? Damage. 7? Times 3. Up to, upwards to 21. Okay. Oh, is Klaus going to take a bullet, or do I take out this one? Whew, made it. Come on, go down, go down. Okay, down. Everybody. Klaus, can you fire at... Oh, you don't reach. Really? What is the range on this guy? Uh, gear. Right there. Bolt action. 37. What are, oh, these are 31s. Oh. We can't hit him, but he can hit us. Oh, that's not good. Hmm. And the animals have followed. Is there any way to stop that? Release. No master. They're going to follow us no matter what. Oh, at least they're in the trees. Okay, well, you're automatically re-aiming. You are too. That's the only one you guys can hit. We're going to have to go around and distract them and, and try to lure them closer. Wow. Okay, that's a little more challenging than I thought. How? What's your aim on everybody else? So Klaus is a 19%. Handy. Can't get there. Shot by, cannot hit target. So Klaus is the only target right now. Okay, well, let's take this one out. You, can you hit any of them? 6% chance. Cannot hit, 7% chance, and 5% chance. Who are you actually shooting at? Do we know? You look like you're aiming at Klaus. 
So Klaus is the target right now. Okay, Lucia. Oh, that one was close. He is definitely our target right now. Boom, 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 boom. Just, boy, I'm waiting for that one to come in and take Klaus down. I hope it doesn't happen. Come on, take her down so we can come up with another plan. Down. Dead. Okay. Um, Arison is available to take with us should we win this thing. Good intellectual. Jogger. Steadfast. These are good traits. We'll not do dumb labor, but pretty good at other things. That's a possibility. Um, saw a dead body. Okay, how do we deal with this? These three can hit us. We can't hit any of them. We're going to have to come up with a plan. What is that plan? We could all leave and then go right back. They'll break and follow and then they'll stop and they'll probably have to grab cover somewhere. Hopefully they'll stay in the trees. So that's, that's a possibility. Maybe we can get the animals to go with us. Now, you guys aren't all hanging around with Sangria, right? None and none. There's just no way to tell you guys to go over there. Okay. Well, Sangria, you head to here. Tomasov there. Handy there. Klaus there. And let's see what these guys do. Colonist needs treatment. Klaus! What happened? Health. Left leg. Oh, not good. Not good. I need you mobile. Okay. Well, you don't have far to go. So with that, stand, stood down, stood down, stood down. As soon as they start to move... Hey, how you doing? <laughs> okay. You're moving. I need the others to move. There and there. Okay. Back into place. Klaus, there. Handy there sangria the animals went to sleep oh man they're just gonna get shot accidentally now oh run speeds um i 366 klaus doesn't have any run speed now though three five hearing loss right leg three four what are we at uh, Klaus is a 187. Handy is a 388. Sangria is a 359. We're all pretty even except for Klaus. 358. Okay. Another plan here. If we all moved over to somewhere else, what would that do for us? If we just went further up, but we'll get it, we're going to get ourselves cornered. Hmm. If Klaus went there, and he went there, that's good. It's covered for several blocks through. Sangria. Tomislav stayed there? Boy, I don't like that. Sangria went here. Tomislav went further back there. So we're there and we're there. Where is there to put Tomislav where he's not going to get cornered? If I send him out to here... He could kind of circle back. And I can keep running him around in circles if I have to. That's an interesting idea. Let's try that plan. Oh, Handy got the order to move already. Okay. But we're going to be shooting kind of through animals. Let's go back to here. Went after Sangria already. And you've got good cover. Mm. Yep, they've got better cover. Sangria to shoot. Cannot reach. Okay. we got to move back in. we got to go further away than move back in. Unfortunately, that's what it comes down to. Klaus, you got to go further. And what are they going to do with Tomislav? Okay. Oh, got Sangria. Health. Torso, liver, left eye, that's old. Okay. So we're going away. Draw them out of their cover. Okay, I need that, him moving. Okay, he's moving now. Right there. Klaus, back in. Handy. There. 
Sangria, there. And Tomislav, right where you are for now. Actually, let's just get you working this way right now. You're going there, there, and there. All right. So let's see what happens here. Now they'll be in our range. That's the idea. Can they get there in time? Boom. Oh, we're close. We're way too close. Okay. We've got the advantage of multiple shots. Let's everybody fire at. Ah, Sangria's been hit again. Ability to hit him. 31%. Sangria. 8%. Handy. 24%. Sangria, go there. Yeah. Okay. Tomislav, what are you doing? You're going around. You're going to go to here. Hopefully, that's what saves us. Okay, I needed that. Thank you. So, right shoulder, spine, and right leg. I need some eyes or something. Okay? Aim for the eyes, guys. I need his accuracy to go away. Boom. Good one. Hit. Health. Leg. Stomach. Spine. Again. What was that one? I will, I'll look at that later. Let's take him down. Of course, there's these guys. Sangria. Was that another hit? Left leg that time, I think. Uh, bleeding out rate, 15 hours. Klaus, no immediate danger. Tomislav, where are you? You're still coming around the horn there. Okay, take him out, guys. Okay, victory. And one day the caravan will automatically be reformed. You can reform the caravan now in the world screen. I see how that works. Okay. Um... Victory, what does that mean? You're dead. Mitsuya, female, character, incapable of dumb labor. So you can shoot and you can social. Okay, not interested. And Hutch, male, can grow and can mine. All right, as part of the, melee, the new melee squad, maybe. Um, <laughs> Hutch is pretty. <laughs> Iron willed and a brawler. Okay, can we? Interesting. Although we're all we're all wounded, and he's a brawler, so I can't go in and knock him out. Okay, guys, just try to wing him. Can you do that, Klaus? You stay where you are. Klaus, actually, come out to here. That and Klaus, fire at. Don't hit the muffalo, please. Okay, dead. Arr. Okay. And Handy, no shoot. Klaus, go down. Handy, go over. And it's done. Okay. So we got one out of it. Where'd you go? Right there? Down. Okay. Well... Okay, we lived. Tomasov got into place. He is not injured. Handy's not injured. Klaus is injured with a left leg problem. And Sangria is hurting far more with liver and left leg. Okay. How do we get access to things like the... Can I do that? Architect? Um, orders? Hmm, furniture. Can I... How do we use our bed rolls? So... Gear? Okay. Double bed. I can drop it, but how do I install it? Hmm. Okay. Klaus. Go here and give to pack animal. Doesn't work. Uh, click on this. Install. There we go. Any buildings in here? Nothing to get us out of the cold for the night. No. Okay. Then we're just going to make a little refuge right here. So you're there. And let's see. This pack animal. Where do you go? Right there. What have you got? 
gear. There is a cloth bed roll. I guess we're carrying the other ones. Um, drop that. So you had no more? You have a wooden dresser. Why didn't we sell the wooden dresser? I, oh, it was. It must not have been an option to sell. Okay. Your gear. Inventory. Bed roll. Drop. Sangria. You've got all the hay. Okay. Handy. You've got a bed roll. Drop. And Tomislav. You've got a bed roll. That seems like one too few, but anyway, you install there. Uh, you install there, and you install. What do I want here? Try that again, right there. Install right there. Okay. Um, handy. Undraft. Do that one. That one. That one, that one. Okay, we're gonna. Once you guys are there, Tomislav is going to heal everybody. I need someone to drop some medicine. So you need no gear, medicine, and we're gonna do this stuff. So we're dropping the medicine. Anything else? Let's look things over. How's our needs at the moment? So Muffalo is decent for food. Okay, handy. Rest. Sangria. Okay. Um, I wonder if I cannot imprison. I probably can't get a hold of that prisoner, can I? To heal the prisoner. I don't know about that. Um, let's undraft everybody. You, you're already undrafted. Tomislav, undraft you. And if I were to have you deal with this, capture and strip. Hmm. I need someone to cut a tree because I need some some uh, wood to make a itty bitty little prison to get. Who is this? Arison, who health is going to die in eight point two hours. <laughs> well, okay, let's. I didn't really look at that. No brains and spines. We're all, we're okay there. Your character was interesting enough. Or is it? No. You're the one that... Hmm. I can't heal you. You're not officially a prisoner. Not much I can do for you. Unless I make a prison. I capture you. Then you become an official prisoner. If I leave you behind and you die, the whole colony probably gets a big negative. Oh, boy. I could try and release you, though. There's an idea. Okay. So, I need someone who isn't dying on me. Um, Tomislav, let's have you quickly cut a tree down. Are you... I need 100%. So, let's do you and chop wood right there and there. Tomislav, immediately cut that one down. That one, that one, and that one. You do that while Handy is put in some beds so we can get these guys to go to bed in a in a, uh, in a a bed and turn it into a hospital bed. But that's going to be the easiest one to make a prison out of. Alright, you got that one. So the next one will be Sangria's. And we're missing one bed. I brought six. I was figuring room for two prisoners should it ever happen. Alright, that one's going in and then Sangria's going to get to use that one. Meanwhile, Tomasov is making the uh, logs so that I can structure, build there, and a door there. And this one is a hospital and sangria, rest until healed. Once that one's done, we'll do the same thing for Klaus. Okay, you are a hospital. You. Uh, this is what I want. Rest until healed. Reserved by Handy. No, Handy, you get to build this. This one will be um, owners of Tomislav and Handy. I think Handy can bring all that in one 
pass. Okay, with that, what do I actually need? It's five per, so five, 10, 15, 20, 45. What do we got here? We got enough. Tomislav, come on here and treat Sangria. What's my timing? 50 some minutes or getting, no, no, no handy. Let's, let's get this done. Okay, um, let's get back to roofing. <laughs> and let's get back to roofing. All right, now let's go and capture. Okay, this is now a prisoner bed. Now handy, go and capture. There we go. Tomislav's healing Sangria, then he's gonna heal Klaus. And Sangria is in great shape there. Handy, you've captured. What else is there to do? Um, oh, these are our, our booty, our loot. Okay, I've got, got some meals. Um, let's unforbid that. Handy, can you feed? Tend, cannot feed. So, Arison needs. You don't need it yet. Health, you've got six hours left. So is there anything else left for Handy to do? That's what I'm getting at. Her sleep is probably pretty rough, but not too bad. Um, I want to use up every minute that I can. And it looks like we're not getting back to uh, Freedom's Drift this episode, unless I really do it long, which I could. Episode 100, that'd be a surprise for everyone if it was two hours long. Yeah, that, that's a possibility. Um... Anything else important for Handy to do? If they slept in a building, would it be any better for them? Just out of curiosity. Needs. Klaus. Doesn't say slept in, you know, sleeping in the cold and sleeping on the ground. That probably comes in later. All right, just go on and go to bed. So, Tomasov, when you're done, I'm going to... It won't let me... Let's try that again. There we go. I clicked on the bed, I guess. All right, you're done with that. You're going to get medicine for that. This squirrel is going to go to sleep. I wonder if, how many of our meals are going to get eaten by the animals. Okay, you're going to take care of Klaus. I can see the little puffs of breath. So, needs... Now, do we have slept in the cold? No, we still don't. Okay. And then, Tomasov, you're going to take care of... Hmm, who's got the the uh, herbal medicine? No. So you got the a Scyther Blade and a whole bunch of silver. Handy. Herbal medicine? You've only got the, a Psychic Insanity Lance. How'd you get off so easy? Klaus? No. And this one? No. Getting a little worried here. There it is. Drop. Okay. You. Though I wonder if he would have gotten out of the alpaca, out of the, the, the saddlebags on his own. I don't know if it if it understands that we have it if it's not unpacked. Um, health. You're that. We'll patch you up and send you on your way. That's probably the plan to make sure that we don't get a bunch of negatives after all this thinking that's what I want to do. There was another one. Okay, that's where I went. And Tomislav, you're going for herbals? Good. All right, then. Let's unforbid everything else. Is nobody down here? Okay. And is there anything else on this map that I want to bring back with us? We've got a little bit of carry space left. Although we're picking up some things right now, too. There is that. Okay, all of you guys, strip... And we'll bring back what we can afford to. Probably just the guns. Uh, meals. And these meals. There we go. Uh, one revolver. Great. Not the best shape, but we'll take it. So, Tomislav, you're consuming a simple meal. Let's get you a better one than that. Where are they at? So, if I right-click here, it does me no good. So, I've got to unpack them. Okay. Gear. 
Where are they, though? Here? Oh, we don't have any good meals. We have pemmican and simple meals. Okay, you must be calculating that that's the best plan, so let's do that. Do we build a quick table? <laughs> Klaus, have you slept in the cold yet? You have not. You have a moderate amount of pain. Observe corpses, ugly environment, and disturb sleep four times. That's going to hurt. We're going to be disturbing like crazy. But Tomasov's going to go to bed soon here, and we're going to be done. So you unforbid. All right, so while they're doing that, what's happening over here? And that's what's hard about running two colonies. Remembering that there's another colony going on, and we got to be walking in on both of them. What is Grandma up to? She is cleaning dirt, because there's nothing else to do. Because it's, Why is there no cooking? Oh, because she's not set to cook. She's set to tend right now. Yeah. You guys, we're going to get back in about a day. At the end of this next day. Hmm. Grandma, temporarily, you are a cook. So, in fact, your day is almost over, though, right? You started really early. No, nope, you got some while to go. We're three in the morning. Okay. So, Grandma, let's make you a cook for a little while. And handle right there. No, no, no. I uh, missed something. Grandma. Handle... I want cook one. Handle this before, so I gotta do it that way. Okay, so let's reset you from cleaning dirt. There you are. All right, cooking a fine meal. Um, oh, we're we're good in kibble now. Okay, so you just have a ball. Wood. Let's have you do that first. Grandma, refuel the stove. Okay, now we had. Sea stars, you're over here doing this. Great. Um, Speed, you are down here, kind of opening up the bottom of the base here. Okay, that works. And Natalia, what was that flash? I zoomed in like that, and everything went bright for a second. That was weird. Um, you have managed to clear out all of this. I would imagine during the day the pigs fill it back up. So... But you've got the really high crafting rating. What do you got right now in crafting? You were an 8 to begin with. You're an 11 now. That's why you're plowing through these so fast. Okay. Whereas Michael is a 3. Probably just got has just gotten to a 4 by now. Auto save. Michael. Crafting. Still a 3. Okay. So that's the, the difference. Why? It, there was a flash. Interesting. So we've got a dry thunderstorm here, which is not good. We're going to have to jump out there and and um, put out fires. But I've always wanted to know what's happening over here, one mountain away. And we have no dry... We're, we're clear. So it isn't the same event scattered across the whole world. It does individualize map tiles. I always wondered about that. Okay, well, you guys are fine over here. There's some, even here out in camping, huh? Well, okay. <laughs> um, I haven't missed anybody, right? We do, in fact, have four. We had five total. I feel like I'm missing. Oh, one got away. So three dead, one got away, and one rescued. Okay. And you are prisoner set for release as soon as is possible difficulty 95 yeah you weren't you aren't worth a 95 for us um social combat gear that's fine character needs food is hurting are you mobile yet no you're not okay so we do need somebody to feed him her her soon okay we'll come back to that over here. Yeah, let's run this episode long. This is episode 100. It it deserves it. Mississippi, how much time do you have left? You have quite a bit. Let's send you... There's only room for two people. Side by side. Hmm. I'm thinking that Mississippi was abrasive. Maybe I don't want to do that. Okay, we'll keep you guys separated. Um, did this get done? It did not get done. We're at 34 degrees. Dry thunderstorm. Wouldn't surprise me if it doesn't start snowing soon. We're almost at freezing. Um, Eric needs... You're almost up. David is a little closer. David, I'm going to get you up. 
why don't you come on over, it's four in the morning, get that built and get a roof on this thing. We put a lot of work into getting that planted. Let's not lose it. Now the dry thunderstorm, what does that mean for us? Fire over the... Ooh, that hit mountain though. No, it didn't. Okay, we need, we got to get somebody out here. I want this place not to light on fire. Although, can that reach that? It might not be able to, but zone, home zone, right there. We have a fire. Who? Sea stars, come on out and do it. You're closest. Right there. Just don't get hit by lightning, okay? Now let's watch the rest of this place. We're okay over here. Over there. Hopefully it will rain before that becomes a problem. And I've forgotten all about them. We have alpha beavers. That's right. Of course, I was thinking that our team would be back here real soon. But right now the alpha beavers have scattered, haven't they? They didn't stay as a group. Are there any over here? Yeah, there's two. Three. And I saw one down over here. Yeah, we're going to have to go hunt these guys down. There's one over there. Yeah, they're going to eventually clean out a map on us. They love trees. Alright, over here. Who do I wake up first? I'm thinking one of you two. Handy, you're both went to bed kind of late. Hmm. Health, what do we got here? Well, we've got a long way to go. Ten and ten. Can they travel when they're injured? That's a good question. Um, I'll let this go a little bit further. So over here. And so we got that fire there. Anything else happen in those few seconds I was away? That's getting big. It might give us some free dinners. I don't know. All right, well, David's on there, and he's putting the roof on. Great. You are attempting to recruit purple. Um, yeah, fine. Eric, time to get up. Needs, come grab a meal. You love to do roofs. You'll take care of it. Purple needs to be talked to. We want Purple to join us. Lights just came on. Must be six in the morning. We're flashing. That was another right there. Let's get this one going. Zone. Expand. We're losing trees already to alpha beavers. I don't want to lose more to fire. Oh, hello. Thank you, Alicia. Take care of that. Cargo pods. Right here. Jump to... Oh, close by. Good. Too bad you can't land on a fox. What's coming? Green goo. Insect jelly. 61 of it. Animals are going to love that. We're going to have to go get that. Um, Grandma, you're cooking a fine meal. That's best with a peg leg. David and Eric are busy. Alicia, Miss P, Michael, you put out fires. Good, you're already doing it. So you take care of that. I need a second one. By the time you get there, it's going to spread. Kaya, what you up to? You are consuming a fine meal, then you'll probably grab another fire. Anybody else already up? Shantigo is making kibble. Let's get you out here to beat out a fire, too. So you take over that one. Between you two, you should be able to handle it. Rabbit, you are playing chess. You must really be needing it. It's not even close to... To 10 o'clock. Not really needing it that bad. Okay, over here. Handy. How much sleep have you had? Uh, we're going to be traveling today, too. So I do want to make sure that you get a uh, enough sleep. Let's go just a little bit further. You're even worse. Klaus, you're probably the one. Let's go ahead and feed Arison. Then you can go right back to bed. Muffalo's up. Back over here. Any more fires that happened while I was away? Is it still going? It is still going. Burning pretty good over there now. There's a new one. And zone. Expand into there. And let's see who gets that trigger. Rabbit, you are playing chess. Congratulations. You get to beat out a fire. And Chantigo is Kathra. You're sowing area. Let's go sow that fire over there. Okay, that's two of you going that way. I got two going up this way, and it's spreading. And Alicia took care of that one. Oh, a cow is pregnant. Okay, well, that will solve a mystery. We have one bowl. 
and the thought was came through the comments that animals are monogamous in this game and so yeah I would need two bulls to impregnate two cows we've got cow one pregnant we've got cow two pregnant so maybe so on certain types of animals but not all animals okay that's good to know so it's kind of hard to remember what used to be in previous versions of RimWorld and what is now. The rules change with every update as they decide to rebalance things and do things a little bit differently. So, Miss P, you are beating out a fire. Everyone's kind of on beating out fire duty, aren't we? Except for Alicia. Um, it might be helpful. Hmm. Do I send them over there or not? Problem is, I have no idea if it's actually going to start raining. And if I do send you over here, you can bring back that turkey when it dies. Yeah, come on over here and help out with that one. What was that? Eric's no longer incapable of walking. Arison. All right. With that, Klaus, you're going to get yourself a meal. And then hopefully you're going to go back to bed. Everybody's getting, oh, so many disturbed sleeps. They're going to come back nervous wrecks. Okay, you going to go to bed now? Deep talk with someone. The Muffalo? Um, <laughs> deep talk with Sangria. Oh, good. Look at that. Those numbers are so much better. So they don't socialize on the trip. They only socialize here in, you know, third person view. And that's done. You're capable of walking soon. Very poor. But we can get rid of you when we leave. That's good to know. Just need to get these guys a little bit closer to healed. And then we'll get going. So, that was in the night. It was, it was, I want to say, we'll go with midnight when the battle ended. Does that sound right? Was that battle entirely in the night? In the dark? I get a day after that before they can take off is what I'm getting at. Do we have all day long to heal these guys who won't necessarily be sleeping. They can be healing because they get their disturbed sleeps how many times now? Four times when they're actually resting. But Klaus is not resting anymore. So I don't think he's going to get any more disturbed sleeps. He's just healing. Okay, that's good. So you guys are taken care of. I can ignore you. What else has happened over here since? We have two over here beating this out. Michael's just getting there. And Shantigo, you're going for that one. Get out of the middle of the fire, please. Go, 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 go. Shantigo. Prioritize, do that one. Thank you. Boy, I don't like that. Okay, you guys got that one. Over here. Haven't arrived yet. Got another one over here that's just formed. So, next to a couple of boom rats. Uh-oh. So, zone. Guys, put out this fire. Anything else closer? Anything else we're missing? No, okay. So we have three main fires to deal with, and then I guess we're all going to have to head up into that one. I'm hoping it's going to rain before then. Still a dry thunderstorm. Still happening. All right, sea stars. we got all five going over here. Um, that's plenty. I need people over here. Let's go to this one. Alicia's heading that way. Catherine's rabbit is. Okay. Got a whole crowd going this way. <laughs> um, Grandma... Ha ah. thinking of the running speed of these two and how much more I could get from them if they didn't do this. David, I'm sending you this way. You can help out over here. And what is that? That is a dead rat. Ah, uh, dead for four days, deteriorating, rotting. Okay, you're forbidden. Whatever killed you, we're not going to be uh, eating you. But let's have these two stay. Mr. P, you're kind of, well, you're kind of already there. Okay. So, Grandma and Natalia, work. Grandma, fire, nope. And Natalia, nope. And Mr. P, because you're pig leg also, and I don't want you running all the way across when I could really use you to do something else. Well, we'll let you go. And you two reset. And go and make more meals and more blocks or what have you. These guys have got this taken care of. Sea Star is heading that way. There was another flash. That didn't hit anything. Good. There was another flash before that. There, there. 
when they first hit, they're not, kind of hard to see. It's just a tiny little yellow dot. All right, this whole crowd is heading this way. Good. You guys are all heading this way. And let's go ahead and finish off. It's still, still happening. So zone. Let's go ahead and finish off in here. And they'll do it automatically. Yeah, we just lit again. Yeah, we're going to have to get that taken care of. And then if anybody isn't already in a mood crisis, maybe we'll have them shoot an alpha beaver on their way home. Another flash. What was that last one? Let's take a sweep through here. Still dry thunderstorming. Rain. It's rain. Ah. Okay, we're good. Cancel that one. Cancel that one. Cancel that into the top of the trees. And cancel that. All right. Um, was there something new over here? No, that was over here. That's where it was. Cancel all of that. Okay. So all of you guys, boom, boom. You guys, boom, boom. And everybody along the top here. Boom, boom. But before I send you back, Alicia, Turkey, not downed, okay. Nothing else died over here? No, okay. So, oh, you guys have already dumped meals. <laughs> Let's draft you two. You can come back for that meal in a second. Rabbit, draft. You go here, and let's hunt this one beaver over in this area. Okay. Shoot. Shoot. Fire at. Rabbit's got the sniper. And there's a boom rat, which we could take out right now. Come on, rabbit. Okay, you guys hop over here. Now, there's more alpha beavers in this area, but we're not going to get the advantage of, or get the ability to do anything with them. You are doing what? You're digging at this stuff. Okay, well, we do need the compacted machinery, so that's fine. So, you guys, what's happening over here, though? Over here, we're still sleeping away. We're just happy as can be. Yeah, soaking in the sunshine, 9 in the morning, a good sleep-in day, huh? And we do have extra meals now, so we can go a little bit further, so long as we have enough um, kibble and, and hay, which I'm assuming these guys are going to be munching the grass. You and you. Okay, if you guys could just get hungry before we leave, that would be really good. Um, back over here, Sea Star's going that way, great. And you guys. Come on, Rabbit. You got the aim. Oh, behind a tree. Oh, bad luck. Oh, guys, let's let's do this. Oh, he's eating a tree. Okay, rabbit, come on a little further. There, fire at. I think he got hit. There's a, yep, got something. Revolver in there. Come on, guys. These guys do revenge, so I don't want to get too close. We've struck compact machinery. Yep. Come on, you can do it. There we go. Okay, break. You get you two are going for meals. Kathra had one of those meals at one point. I think Alicia grabbed it. Needs you need to eat. So eat on your way after hauling him home. Oh, Alicia. Okay, Alicia, you haul home. Kathra, go eat. Thank you. Perfect. And then when you're done, haul in the gold. Anything else to haul in here? Um, and Rabbit, when you're done, haul in a load of steel. Right there. Okay. That was worthwhile. So three beavers over here at least. There's something else. Is that a turtle? Nope, that's a... Yeah, yeah that's a turtle. So three beavers here. There's got to be more. There, were, there weren't that many, though. Six or seven at the most. Just got to go find them all. Okay, so you guys have got your orders over here. This has been mostly filled in. 
Um, Eric is playing horseshoes and doesn't need it. Eric, fill in roof, 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 and that switch, and then turn this on. Oh, and then there. And then, Eric, turn that on. Okay. So you make that happen. David, you are playing chess. Need it? Not really. Well, you're heading down kind of low. I'll, I'll let you. Okay. Grandma, you are relaxing socially. Shantigo, you are butchering. Good. We're about out of meat. Rabbit's up there. Natalia, meteorite. Oh, that can't be good. Handy's up. Okay, I've got to come back to these guys, then we'll probably call this one done. But meteorite, large meteorite has struck the ground. Jump to, okay, well, you're far enough away, you're not going to kill us. Thank goodness. Be gold, please. Be solid gold. Solid gold. What you going to be? Uranium. Well, okay. Okay. Things made of uranium sell for huge numbers. Okay, yep, that, that'll be fine. I'm not going to mine it for quite a long time, though. i got to remember that it's here. It doesn't really look much different from marble. So, <laughs> anyway, back over here. What we got going? What, what's it going to take to get these guys... Where are you going, Handy? To get these guys uh, huh, on their way. we got most of the day with these extra meals. It's not raining over here to ruin the meals. Um... I'm thinking about mining compact machinery. Handy going for a walk needs... You're in great shape. Let's do some mining while we're here. Let's take out these four. Steel is going to be a bit heavy. I don't know how much the compact machinery is going to weigh. But... Let's do that. And right over there. Right there. Okay. Handy... You can, well, let's keep it to this side, though, because it's e easier to load. You do that. Tomislav, when are you getting up? Needs, you could be getting up soon. Yeah, rest is already heading down for these guys, so that'll keep us even. So, Tomislav, come on over and work on this for me. Now, what was your mining skill? Um, mining, four. Handy was better. Mining. Six. Klaus. Good. Well, seven. But, whoa. Really? Harvesting oak tree. Uh, cancel you. Handy. Back to this. Thank you. It's not one of their priorities, so they're going to get really distracted. But while you're doing that, I wanted to see health-wise. Where are we at? We've got 35 of 40, that's good. 18 of 20, that's great. And that was that's 12 away. That's the that's the big one. Left leg. Klaus. And you're walking, so that cuts our our speed down. There's six away and four away. So really it's, it's up to hand, uh, Sangria. But let's watch these guys for a little bit. And Tomasov gave up. He's gonna feed a meal to Sangria. Yep, yeah, that's that's probably good. Rather than make her do it. Let's let her heal as long as possible here. I don't know if the longer we stay here, the longer the chance is that something else can happen to us here. Who knows? Um, Eric, you got it done? You got it done. There's no more rain in here. Perfect. You guys go find other things to do. Everyone's programmed to do something. There should be no idle workers. And let's kind of... Finish up over here. Oh, good. You're going to finish what I asked you to do. Wonderful. So, do we know what you weigh? Mass, 0.6 kilograms. Not bad. Okay, make me a bunch of them. So, I can do the work schedule here. I wasn't sure if I could. Okay. So, mining right now is... Well, we could just do that to keep it happening. I guess so. Okay. Hmm. Wonder if we want to do any hunting and bring any meat back with us. 
No, nope, I think the uh, compact machinery is worth more than about anything else on this map. There's no gold over here that I've seen. I've only seen steel. No, nope, that's it. Okay. So, 1300 hours, 1 p.m. When do we get going? We lost Klaus because he's hungry. I'm not Klaus, Thomas Love. That's fine. If you're going to do that, that is the end of the simple meals. We have left right there four package meals. And then we've got our, our, um, whoa, saw a dead body. Okay. Do we have them strip them? I think so. Let's do that. So we've already set them to strip. Um, Tomislav, needs are there. Handy, there. Tomislav, you get the best mood. Let's have you strip, strip, strip. And then when we leave, we can choose if we want to bring any of that with us. Hopefully it gives us a value and we can choose just the best of them. But at that point, it should be available to us as an option. Klaus, you're going to be done here real soon, aren't you? Three away, one away. Sangria's worst is still 11 away. Okay. Once Klaus is up and going, that's probably the time to uh, to think about packing up. Because so we're going to be getting late in the day. They're not going to get far. They're just going to really become officials, what they're going to get. Which means Sangria will get to go right back to sleep again and hopefully heal in the night. Hopefully that's a thing. Uh, they're all stripped. You guys are busy working over here. Let's set that one for mine. And you're doing which one? You're doing that one. Good. I want to see what's behind. Well, there's not much for me to see here. Let's pop back over here. Kaya is cutting... Yep, marble. That's, that's the marble one. That's the uh, granite one. That's good. Um, Rabbit, you are good. We're getting food. Shantigo is cooking survival meals. We're up to our 60? 60? 66. Ooh, we made it. All right, and the survival meals are going to get dropped into here again. What was that weird flashing thing? No more flashy things. Huh. What was that? I scrolled over, and unless it was my eye twitching funny, I saw something. I just saw it again. I guess it's just the way the graphics are on my monitor. Something odd there. Um... I was just looking at this. Jantico's cutting up a boomalope. When I first played RimWorld, and I first came across boomalopes, it said when they die, they explode. And I think I found a dead one out here somewhere. And, you know, that one of those very first games that I played, I was afraid to bring it in and butcher it. I just, I didn't know if it was going to explode again when you cut into it or not. I, I think I threw away that first boomalope, not knowing what to do with it. <laughs> So, Klaus is fully healed over there. It is 4 p.m. Let's get to 5 p.m., then we'll check up on... Uh, what we're doing here? Harvesting. We'll check up on Sangria and see how she's doing. Michael making kibble. Good. Alicia, you are cutting an oak tree. Good. Getting the last of our trees down over here. Um, that needs to go away. Uh, this needs to go away. And we're good there. Yeah. Um, Alicia, you are... And Eric, you are... Consuming a fine meal. Now you're working on... You know, you're working on consuming a fine meal. I see. David, you are trying to get Klaus's room up and going. Can you bring the blocks over to this one? And who's breaking right now? Michael, making kibble needs... What can I do for you? Not much. I can get you off of kibble duty is about all I can do. Let's do that and see what you want to do. I could make you art. Bet you'd love that. And I could really use some more statues. Let's do that. Cook right there. Michael, you're the only one, though. Oh, Grandma. Let's see if the two of you, since we're already... The two of them together are the reason we have the 66 meals. So I'm only calling for 20 or 30 of these. When that's done, they'll have nothing to do but kibble. Okay. Between the two of them, they can probably keep us up because their skills are so much better than these other ones who are asking to come in and do this. They can do this, and they can do it twice as fast. I like that. Michael, why don't you go back to arting? Right over there, art. All right, and let's break you now. Uh, boom, boom. Hauling unfinished wooden large sculpture. Good. And 5 o'clock, we're there. Who I didn't see here? 
There, there, Kaya. What are you at right now? You're right there. Okay, we're good. So we're on this side. Uh, Klaus is digging at limestone. You're you're just gonna dive in and do some some. Uh, oh, we're done over here. There, there. So we're about to leave. Are we done? <clears throat> Sangria, how you doing? Health. One thing left. It's your leg. <clears throat> your run speed now is not bad. Not bad. It's just a matter of whether it's going to become infected or something later. But I think it's time to leave. So, Tomasov, let's have Handy do this instead. I can't. Okay. Then you break. Handy, you come over and do this. And you unbreak. All right. So, the rest of them are going to do what? Oh, I queued that up. Okay, let's... Um, there, there, there. Let's cancel that. And you're going to what? Cloud watch. Milking muffalo. <laughs> okay, that works. <laughs> so with that, I guess, well, we're waiting on this. Okay. So let's do something I almost never do. Take you to fast speed. Bum, 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 bum. 1800. Whoa, what was that? Klaus. Let's not go too far away. We're done. Okay, let's get out of here. World. There. Reform Caravan. We're all going. What is the red here? Mass Capacity Klaus. I don't understand what that means. Like he's carrying too much? Uh, cancel. Back in there. Klaus, you have on you gear. Bunches of stuff. Let's dump the steel. Okay, now let's go back in here and see if that did anything. So, reform caravan, that did something. Okay. So, we want all of these to go. Oh, we're not done yet. Cancel. Uh, zoom in again. I want Klaus to release already did unowned okay then I need someone to uninstall these that's what I'm missing okay so handy you're my uninstaller you've got a little clock right there what does that mean you're wandering I guess that's what that means you uninstall uninstall sorry sangria we're gonna take it right out from underneath you uh, handy let's uninstall and Uninstall, uninstall, and then Sangria's. Oh, Sangria's out. Okay. Then we can leave, right? I can't think of anything else to do. We're just going to leave that little hideaway there. All right. Are we good now? I think we are. World. Lost, yep. Over here. Reform Caravan. Everybody there. Items. What are we taking with us? So, these are things that we... I mean, I assume we're taking everything. Oh, that's, uh, that's the one they rot. That's right. Okay. So, I guess I've just got to go through here and manually say yes to everything except for obvious things that I don't want. Bed rolls. Okay, we don't want the chunks. If I got anything yet I don't want. Got components, 16 of them. They don't weigh that much at all. Good. Is that per... That might be per. Anyway, we got 40 pounds of capacity left. That's a little scary. But although we were already carrying a whole bunch of stuff. Okay, we're already carrying things. So, all those. Don't need the chunks. Don't need the corpses. The wood would be nice. We'll leave that for last, though. Let's get weapons. Both of those. Still got room. Down in here, we got a... What's the best quality stuff? Can we see value? Um, boy, not much value. You, you, and you. Okay. That's really the bottom. Okay. So, in that case, wood. Grab all of it. And we go over. So, start. No, we didn't go over. Wait a minute. Point one. Boy, does it get any closer than that? 248.41 out of 248.5. 
<laughs> we can still get in a cloth toque at 70 grams. <laughs> We're at 39 cents, so, so no. Um, so we got those guys there. Yeah, I guess we've got a load. All of those. Skipping all of this. Corpses and chunks. Didn't get any accidentally right there. There, I got one accidentally. Okay, that cleared up a lot of space. Whoa, limestone chunk. Yep, that cleared out a lot. Is there anything else you want to bring then? Bring in that last wood. And I, I can bring that one, but I'm, there's no point in getting the, the other ones. That it then? That is it. Except the caravan has been reformed. You go here. 0.9 days left. Food, 3.7. We're good. And I'd say with that, we're going to call this one done. That was episode 100, and that's a wrap. It's been Noble Rambler. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye-bye.